Hi, my name is Ankit Chamoli and I'm with my friend Arvind Mohan. The title of this video is two key things to make any relationship work. Before we go any further in the video, I'll tell you one thing. If you are looking for quick fixes, this video isn't for you. Because these two key ideas, when you apply over time, you'll surely succeed in your relationship. So let's get started. First thing is listening properly. What is listening properly? Listening properly is listening with all attention. And it's also much more than that. But let's divide this listening into two categories. Listening for men and listening for women. So listening for men. Whenever women are in a situation that is a problematic situation, they always try to talk. They always think the solution or they try to find the solution through talking. And it's not always they are trying to find a solution. Most of the time, they're just looking for someone who is willing to listen to them. Who is simply willing to listen to them. This is what most of the men think. Like, whenever they are talking with their partner, they'll be like, okay, you can do this, do that, do this. They are telling them the solutions. But she's not interested in the solutions at all. She just wants you to listen to her. That's all. With all your willingness to hear, with all your willingness to listen. This is what she wants. Second thing is listening for women. Now, whenever men are in a problematic situation, they, they try to, you know, isolate themselves. They try to go inside a, a cave and they don't want to talk to anyone. They just try to find a solution themselves. Because that's what men have been doing. They have been trying to find the solutions for themselves. And what women take this is a sign of withdrawal from the relationship. They think that they are not able to fulfill their partner, uh, partner's choice or, or whatever. They think that the relationship is not working because they feel that the man is withdrawing. But he's not withdrawing. He's just trying to find a solution which he'll definitely find within himself he doesn't want uh, to discuss and because women whenever they are in a problematic situation they try they want to discuss this doesn't work with men they always try to go inside a cave or isolate themselves and disconnect themselves and try to find a solution themselves so this is how men think and this is how women think it's all opposite but when these opposite ends meet they'll surely create wonders Listening properly is all about that. The second key idea is love. Now, what I'm gonna speak may sound unintuitive, but I'm gonna help you with a story. Let's say you have a friend Jack. He plays awesome football. He enjoys the game very much and the enjoyment which he gets out of the game is incredible. For some reasons, he didn't play for like two months and you meet him and you find that he is not that same person. He has become a dull person. He's, he's like, he's not feeling good at all. He's feeling very dumb and, and dull. And he's not at the highest of his moods, which he was when he was playing the game. Now, as a friend, what would you suggest to him? Of course, you might, you will be suggesting him to play the game again because he enjoys it. And he's in the best of the moods when he's playing the game. So. It is what he enjoys, the enjoyment which he gets out of it is amazing. And the only thing is to play that game, to enjoy, to get the feeling of enjoyment. This is the same thing which goes with love. Love is a verb, an action word. It can be defined as a verb. So love is basically an action word. Love, you need to do love to get to the feeling of love. That feeling of love is what is lacking in many of the relationship at later stages. If you want to get to that feeling of love again, start love, loving. That's how you will achieve greatness in your relationships. Thank you, best wishes.